Chief Secretary Henry Tang and the Chief Executive's Office Director Raymond Tam donned sportswear to join a mixed doubles friendly with top local badminton players Amy Chan and Yip Poi Yin. Henry Tang had Poi Yin as his partner. The Chief Secretary is a sports enthusiast and enjoys playing badminton with family and friends. He recently hurt his left knee while playing with his daughter and had to wear a brace. Raymond Tam had not played badminton since graduating from university, but he quickly found his footing when partnered with Amy Chan. The competition was keen, but it didn't matter to this foursome who won or lost. They just wanted to enjoy the game. These sports fans also shared their views on sports development in Hong Kong. They agreed hosting the 2023 Asian Games could set a clear target for athletes and benefit the whole community. Our intention to host the 2023 Asian Games is, uh, is uh, basically we want to give the younger generation, especially the athletes, a target, a goal that they can, they can, they can reach for. Because by organizing the Games, not only can we promote uh, the sp uh, spirit of sports, but also allow the young, younger generation to have something that they could work for. Mr. Tang said the cost of hosting the events would not detract from the government's commitment to improving people's livelihood. As far as community resources are concerned, uh, such as welfare, health, and also uh, other labor and welfare related expenses, none of it will be affected by the expenditure because the government has committed ourselves that we will continue to expand the amount that we have always budgeted for, for health, welfare. Amy was the top local badminton player in the 1980s. Poi Yin just won a bronze medal in the Guangzhou Asian Games. Amy says she appreciated Poi Yin's efforts and determination. You can see her growth, you know, uh, from very young, uh, since um, the age of 12 till now. She has been, you know, all through this process from, from, uh, from nobody, you know, to, you know, to somebody um, that she has paid a lot of effort in, in, uh, in, in, in this process. And also, you know, and now everyone see her as a very successful athlete. When I joined the Hong Kong team, my skills were poor and I did not pay attention to my coach's instructions. I lost to teammates who were much younger. I understood I had to train hard after these failures. Otherwise, I wouldn't be a successful badminton player. It isn't just athletes who need to have a goal. Amy said the bid to host the 2023 Asian Games is also an opportunity for the community to work together and enhance harmony. I think we, we need to set a goal, you know. Um, for 2023, we, we're talking about uh, 12 years later. Um, and actually, I, I, I think we, we need to, you know, enter the game, you know, instead of, instead of just talking. You know, we, we need to have, you know, a real proposal for this.